doing this off season to prepare for next season? Um, one of the big things I've been doing is cooking, honestly, but getting my nutrition right um, is a big thing for me, especially with going through an injury, understanding my body, what my body needs on a daily basis. So learning how to cook has been a lot of fun, but getting in the weight room, getting as strong as I can, um, just doing different movements, getting in the cage, um, lots of film sessions, just trying to understand and kind of not reinvent the wheel, but kind of just like work backwards from the success I did have this year, what I did, what I didn't do so great, and just continuing what I did good, but also trying to improve on the stuff that I didn't do so great. What are your goals going like into this camp and then into spring training and into the season? I mean, my goal is to win a job. That, that's the biggest thing on my plate. Um, and how do I do that? I just try to be me, the best version of myself every single day. I'm not gonna you know, worry about who's with me because there's probably gonna be a gold glover right there in front of me. So it's like going in, I'm just gonna be the best version of Josh Young I can be every single day. What do you think is gonna be the difference maker this year from last year? Can I be consistent? Because I got hurt, I missed time. I only got half the season played. So it's like, can I? come out, be consistent, but be consistent for a longer period of time than just this, the small sample size that I had last year. Okay, um, so what have you been doing to prepare this off season? Um, you know, from a physical standpoint, I've been working out. I was at Vanderbilt in Nashville and, um, you know, just keeping your body in really good shape. And from a pitching standpoint, it's working on certain pitches. Um, for me particularly, I was working on uh, my slider and changeup this this uh, off season, and I feel like it was a very productive off season. So you're going into this camp in Arizona. What are you hoping to gain afterwards? I think just you know, I think part of baseball, the most important part, is the relationships that you build with players and coaches. And obviously, I haven't been able to play a whole season with with the Rangers yet because. Um, because the season went so late for college baseball last year, I wasn't able to play this summer. But that's what I'm most excited for is the memories built on and off the field and the relationships that I'll keep for a long time. What is it about the Rangers specifically that you're excited for? Um, I mean, in terms of the Rangers, I think there's no organization that's set a culture like they have, um, if that makes sense. From the top down, everyone just really wants to win, and that's kind of the culture that's been developed. It's a super competitive one, and I've always been a pretty competitive person who, who does love to win, so that's pretty, um, pretty awesome to hear. So going into your first professional season, what's going to be the difference maker going from college to the pros? Um, I think it's just the fact that it's, it's a much longer season, the pro season versus the college season. Um, but. In terms of baseball, it's, it's preparing for a lineup the same way. It's going to sleep the night before and visualizing that lineup that I'm going to face the next day. And, you know, going through my warm-up routine and putting my, myself in a physical and mental um, prepared place to, you know, pitch and compete at a high level. What have you been doing this offseason to prepare? Uh, just working out, um, throwing, uh, lifting, and just trying to do everything conditioning-wise to get my body in a good spot. Um, what's going to be the difference maker this year from last year? I think it's just trying to build on what I did last year and come in with a little bit better plan of what I want to do, how I want to do it, and you know, trying to formulate that plan and you know, attack it during the season. What are your goals for this season? Goals, obviously, at the top is make it to the big leagues, but not just make it to, to stay there. I think that's the toughest part. And then, you know, like I said, just have a, have a season like I did last year, but build on it and you know, continue to grow. So going into this camp um, in Arizona, what are you, what's the biggest thing you're looking to gain? I think just getting more knowledge about myself and, and pitch characteristics and you know, how my stuff plays. So I think uh, getting with the guys in Arizona, the pitching coaches, I think it'll be a good little camp to get going. So what have you been doing this off season to prepare for this next season? Uh, to get ready this season, I've been lifting four days a week, um, conditioning, um, keeping the arm healthy, um, just trying to maintain my body to stay healthy and get ready for spring training. Perfect. And then you can, so what's going to be the difference maker from last year to this year? Uh, just staying healthy and being able to compete multiple, I mean, just long lasting and throughout the year and just being able to uh, complete all my innings and hopefully
hopefully uh, make a big jump this year. Perfect. Um, what are your goals going into this season? Um, just to be there for the team and whatever they need to do. Um, just obviously you want to make it to the big leagues, but if it ain't next year, then hopefully it's the next. So going into this camp in Arizona, what are you most looking forward to? Uh, just seeing everybody again. Uh, I just love the, the friendship that I have here with the Rangers and all my teammates. Okay, so what have you been doing this off season to prepare? Uh, yeah, so I've been... Look at me, not camera, look at me. Okay, yeah, so I've been working out, uh, working out, hitting, running, trying to stay in shape. Uh, me and my wife will go on walks every now and then in the morning just to kind of stay active. Uh, it's been fun, though, just hanging in. Okay, yeah, yeah. So honestly, just the work I've put in, uh, just trying to trying to get a little bit stronger. I try to put on a little bit of weight. Uh, I think I gained like five pounds or so, but trying to put on some good weight. Um, staying strong in the weight room, hitting ground balls, getting better uh, at shortstop, um, wherever really, just trying to, trying to be consistent in my swing and everything. What are your biggest goals? My biggest goal, so I always say, uh, is obviously to make it to the big leagues. Um, that's my, my number one goal every year. Uh, personally though, just for me to have fun this year, uh, not take this game for granted, you know. Uh, get to play a kid's game and get paid for it, so it's pretty fun and just really get to enjoy this year doing that. Perfect. What's the biggest thing you've been doing this off season to prepare for the uh, this off season, I've been uh, in the weight room quite a bit. I've been um, on the field, taking ground balls, fly balls. Uh, been in the batting cage, working on my approach, my offensive tools, and just trying to stay sharp and be prepared for 2022. What are you most looking forward to during this mini camp in Arizona? Um, I just plan to take stuff in, soak everything in, and uh, listen to all the resources I have around me, and just get better prepared for the season. What's going to be the biggest difference maker this year from last year? Uh, the biggest difference maker, uh, I think I'm more prepared than I was last year. I'm uh, more polished, and uh, yeah, I think I'm, I'm going to be ready to go. What are your biggest 2022 goals? Uh, I'm just going to take it day by day, do what I can, control what I can control, and just play the best I can. and come out every day and compete with all I got.